Okay, dear students. So let us see in this question what is happening. A liquid that contains negative charge carriers is flowing through a square pipe of side A, B, C, D. A magnetic field acts in the direction shown across the pipe. On which side of the pipe does the negative charge accumulate? So basically the question uh, uh, just wants you to find the direction of the force that will be applied on the negatively charged uh, ions that are those are flowing in the liquid. So uh, what are we going to do here is so in this such kind of questions we have to use the Fleming's uh, uh, left hand rule. Uh, but instead of a Fleming's right hand rule or left hand rule because they are highly confusing I prefer using the right hand palm rule and I tell you this is uh, far more easier to be used and these are far more effective than the Fleming's hand rules although the, this rule it has been derived from the Fleming's rules only. So you can search for this on Google and you can self learn on this if you uh, would be requiring some help please do let me know I will I would be happy to help you so uh, in this case there are this right hand rule is used in three different types so type number one is the direction of the magnetic field as produced by the current so this is used when the current is given and they say that the magnetic field is produced because of the current and you are supposed to find the direction of the current a direction of the magnetic field in the second case, we need to find the direction of the force on charged particles as our question is asking us for or the current carrying conductor because current carrying conductor is also it is uh, taken to be uh, as if the positive charge is flowing through the wire. So one is the same thing. And in type 3, this rule is used to find the direction of the induced current. So there are three different ways in which we can use this rule. But in our question, we would be using it only and uh, we should be using only the type two of this uh, method. So what is this type two? Let me please explain you. Give me a couple of minutes more. See, this is our right hand now. So we have to point our fingers towards the magnetic field as shown. So just imagine this 3D body um, to be placed on your table and try to imagine where is your magnetic field so magnetic field as we can see it is given that it is moving from uh, right to left so i am using my right hand so you can see here that my hand is placed like this so my hand is placed towards the uh, the right okay my hand is placed like this in a horizontal manner and my thumb is pointed towards the screen See, my thumb is towards the screen. Now, the thumb must point towards the direction of the motion of the positive charge. But uh, unfortunately, here they are talking about the negative charge carriers. So what we do is the negative charge is moving in this direction. So we will assume that the positive charge is moving in the opposite direction. So coming back to our right hand. So I am placing right hand like this and my thumb is pointing in the opposite direction. Okay, as given in your question, the negative charge is going towards coming out of the book, but the positive charge will be taken to be going inside into the book. So now, where is the palm looking? So palm is looking upside. So palm is looking upside, upwards. So this way I can say that it they will be experiencing a force in the upward direction. So in this rules, palm is always finding the unknown variable and in our question the unknown is the direction of the force so force will be in the upward direction so answer should be a so let us verify it from the mark scheme and yes as you can see the answer given is a so this is how we do it um, many words cut short i will tell you uh, instead of Fleming's uh, right hand or left hand rule try to learn right hand palm rule Please try to self-search it, self-learn it. If you face any problem, please do let me know. I will explain it. Explaining these things are definitely more difficult because we are sitting online. But I will try my best to tell you. So please do send me the feedback on in the comment section for this. All the best. Bye.